Hey everybody, this is Deepak Khatri, and welcome to my short crappy shots. In this video, we are going to take a look at this puppy. This is comp book from Eyeball. It costed ten thousand rupees when it was new, and it came with Windows Ten. I upgraded. Yeah, upgraded it with the Linux. This is how it looks from the front. It's totally worn out. This one is about four year old, and I have removed the keyboard because it was not working and very filthy. So I just removed it. The power key was in the keyboard and. Just because the keyboard was not working, the laptop was not starting, so I hacked it. And if you open up this port uh, on the back side, you will see test points for the power button. What I did, uh, I soldered two wires: this blue wire and the black wire for the power button. It worked for some months, and then it stopped working. Then it got uh, into the dump. So what I did today, I removed this battery. I soldered two wire on the test point for the battery, and I use the charger that came with this laptop, and it is working on five volts now. Let's talk about the board now. This computer chip motherboard uh, has an Intel Atom processor, two gigs of RAM, and thirty-two gigs of EMMC storage. The display port is also worn out. I used some hot glue to fix this. This is the Wi-Fi chip. This is the antenna. A board is missing here. This board, and it provides audio jack, a USB connector, and a micro SD connector. <coughs> A micro SD jack, uh, whatever you call it. There is a USB A connector here, and a micro SD my jack. I have installed Fedora Linux on this computer, and believe me or not, I learn machine learning on this laptop. Because I can run Python, I can run Jupyter Lab, and that's all I needed to learn all the machine learning stuff. And Fedora is my all on partner. I love Fedora. So here we can see. <coughs> Here's the login screen. The trackpad is not working, but it doesn't matter. Because I just want the computer to work, I have just botched everything, and it is working. That's all I want. I can use external keyboard and mice with this computer, and somebody could use it for anything they want. <coughs> because it is running a fully fledged Linux Linux operating system, uh, which is a great thing to see here. That's all from this video. I think this podge, I think this hacked laptop inspires you to fix your own old laptop, which might not be as complicated as this one because I had to solder on very thin tracks uh, to get it to work. Uh, I hope your laptop is way better than this one, and I hope you create. A video like this, share it with me, and <coughs> the whole point of uh, creating th this video is to encourage you to not create. Uh, the whole point of this video is to encourage you to not create e-waste and recycle, reuse things. Uh, specifically, old computers like this, which are might be old, too slow, but not for uh, a Linux. 
operating system this one is running fedora linux xfce which works great uh, as i have already told you i learned machine learning on this laptop and i had no problems with it it runs uh, arduino also and i used it to program my arduino boards which is a great thing if you know what i'm saying because this one is this laptop is very slim and when this battery was inside this laptop uh, it ran uh, it could run for about 10 hours more than 10 hours uh, with maximum performance uh, i could see youtube videos 720p uh, that was nice this screen is 1080p so the picture quality is good the brightness is good what else do you want I hope you liked this video, if you did, share it, subscribe and I'll see you in the next one, peace.